Thanks for joining us. We have an exclusive interview today with the person who nabbed a suspected local child predator. Predator Poachers, a group that goes after underage sex crime offenders, conducted a sting at the airport, and that sting led to an arrest by Lafayette Police. 46-year-old Jerry Case Jr. is in jail today on one count of felony indecent behavior with a juvenile, computer-aided solicitation of a juvenile, sexual abuse with an animal, and pornography involving juveniles. Tonight, only on 10, Predator Poachers is interviewed by KLFY senior reporter Renee Allen. First, however, we must warn you, the content and video may be disturbing to some viewers. Alex Rosen is a representative of Predator Poachers. Rosen says he was at the Lafayette Airport on Monday to meet Case, who he says was there to meet a 12-year-old he thought he was dealing with online. You video chat. Make sure that who you are, you know what I mean? And, and you know, that's, that's all I need. I need. Alex Rosen of Predator Poachers says the case of Jerry Case Jr. has been on their radar for almost a month. He sent videos um, of him um, pleasuring himself. He sent videos of his own dog pleasuring him. Also, Rosen provides an audio recording of Case and the supposed 12-year-old who actually, unbeknownst to Case, as an adult female with the predator poachers. I mean, how nervous would I be or whatever? I know I'm nervous already. <laughs> yeah, yeah, me too. Me too. But, oh well. Yeah. Do it Rosen says Case was under the assumption the girl was flying in from Huntsville with another underage female friend to visit family in Lafayette. He was just waiting, standing across from three cops that were just there. I mean, that didn't even phase him at all. Rosen says Case eventually agreed to talk about it outside. Um, he admitted to wanting to do intimate things with these two girls. He admitted to talking to 20 or 30 other um, profiles that at least represented themselves as underage. Rosen explains Case came off nervous to be confronted. He started blaming Facebook for this, his problem. He started blaming other people for him being into this stuff. Like he, the bestiality video, he claimed that it was someone else's idea for him to go do it. Predator Poachers has other similar cases in other okay. states. The Case's reason, case, we're told, is the just the one of many. And um, yeah, he's, he said he's been in these teen groups for like three years now, and he's just sick. Lafayette police confirmed that they were not part of the sting, but were contacted once things got underway. Renee Allen reporting for KLFY News 10. Renee, thank you. We will have a link to this story on our website at klfy.com.